to another room he wanted to call his mom and the cameraman literally wanted to follow him he was like hey hey oga <laughs> no come near me don't come he literally told the guy told the cameraman that see don't come i need my space and all of that he has the storyline i know she has to tell but the whole point of the song is don't fall for me i mean i like you you're pretty you're sexy but let's don't follow like i know i like you but don't don't pass this line because if you pass the line I will go, me i'm just here because i like you so the, but it's i mean it's something that i'm experiencing it's something that people experience so i feel like yeah that's the story we have it. i mean sometimes i just want to keep uh, some of the stories uh, it's but the fact is, I'm actually experiencing that, so it's, it's real. Hi. Good evening. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Zainab, and on this channel, I give very hot and spicy gist. So if that sounds like something you're interested in, please hit the subscribe button to become a part of my channel. I talk about movies, I give movie reviews, I talk about your favorite TV shows, and guess what? I also talk about your favorite celebrities so if that sounds like something you're interested in hit the subscribe button hit it hit it hit it turn on the bell beside it so that you always know anytime i post a video and guess what guys i am 1k stronger thank you so much to all the 1000 plus people that have subscribed to my channel you guys are the real mvps i don't want to stain my lip gloss you guys are the real MVPs. Thank you so, 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 so much. So, guys, um, I've actually been, you know, MIA for a while now. I've just been, like, busy for a while. So, I actually uploaded I Am Lecon episode 6 and 7. But after that, I got really busy and I stopped. And I actually, really, I wanted to, you know, just free because I believe that most people would have, you know, watched it somewhere. But I got a very, very um, amazing comment yesterday. Someone was like, they love the way that i explain or give reviews on the on the on the shows that it's like i'm just in and i was so elated i was like oh wow some people actually love the way i you know do these things and you know let me just complete it what's the point of just stop let me just complete it even if you've watched it from somewhere else you know it's all fine and good you know no 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 pressure no um hard feelings at all but let me just put it out there for people that really like what i do so that's why i'm back with episode 8 and episode 9 and episode 10 so guys let's dive into it already enough of the talk 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 episode 8 started from where episode 7 ended obviously um the whole sty stylist problem you know belts the size they brought for him bigger than his normal size and i think i really need to have a word with the stylist because the clothes that he or she is i think it's ella so it's a she the clothes she gives him like big winter like they're like winter jackets to me what's the problem and Leko actually looks really good in fitted jackets fitted suits so why are you giving him like big jackets i really don't know if there is no reason behind him ella giving um Leko on those jackets i really don't see the need for him where i mean wear what you look good in why are you oh <sighs> They need to review that stylist too because winter jacket what's the problem so anyways they just sorted the whole issue out they had their um, video shoot you know at the beach and some scenes as well so moving on guys gang 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 a lack of lagos that's lacon's brother yomi had an accident with the car and the car is not even like lacon's car personal car and stuff the car is actually the record label's car and Shore, who is I think the record manager or something, something, was like, oh, oh, he's always like, if Lekon is not going with you guys, you guys should not go with the car. Go with something else. But I guess, you know, they'll be like, oh, there's really no problem. But, you know, unfortunately, they had an accident with the car. Very, very, you know, bad accident. But thankfully, um, they, they survived. Thankfully, nobody was, you know, um, hammed and stuff so you know that's actually a plus and i could actually feel like remorse in yomi's um should i say yomi's countenance like it was really so remorseful i think that this is the re most remorseful that i've seen him like in the whole show he was really really re remorseful and stuff even tarela was like hmm Lekon is going to para and this and that because Lekon is always like you guys should be careful blah 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 
and they didn't know how Lekon was going to take it. But in Sirelia's mind, she was like, you know, Lekon is going to para. So when Lekon came now and Yomi was like, you know, they had an accident and all of that stuff, Lekon was like, you know, he started laughing basically. And he didn't para. He was like, you know, hope you guys are safe. And Tyrella was like, are you kidding me? You're not going to shout? You're not talking? Is that all you're going to say? And in my head, I'm like, okay. This is actually like something to be thankful about. I mean, nobody lost their life and that's like the most important thing. I mean, it's not like you had the accident like intentionally. Things happen, but you guys need to really, really be more careful like, you know, subsequently. So, um, Leko was just like, you know, thank God and stuff. They should be careful. And I already prepared his mind. Like, you know, he had prepared his mind for the worst like ever since. So now it's coming like, okay. You know, there's really no nothing that he can do about it. The deed has already been done. Anyways, they shall moved on to discussing about the EP launch. Who are the people they are going to invite for the EP launch and all of that? Excuse me, because of the whole COVID nineteen blah 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 blah. So, anyways, eventually they said we are just going to invite you know close people, um, people that have been there for him through thick and thin and all of that. So they decided um, that those are the people that they are going to invite for the EP launch. Um, so moving on, <laughs> Yomi had been seeing like a lot of bullshit on social media, you know, fans putting pressure on, you guys know, Bibi Ninja fans, Bibi Ninja stands and putting pressure on their faves. So I think he had been seeing like a lot of that. So he needed Lekon to kind of know. And at that time, Lekon was, you know, um, Lekon had been off social media for a while to concentrate on music and on himself. So he had not been seeing like a lot of that. So Yamina I haven't seen like a lot of that, you know, he was not like, come and see you, see what your fans are saying, you know, who, sh who you should be friends with, who you should not be friends with and all of that. And Lekon was like, see, I don't want to see any of these things. That's the whole point. Do not show me. I'm off social media for now. Let it be like, they will be fine. Last, last. And you know, Yami was like, you know, you need to see this. And he was like, no, that he doesn't want to see it that you know he's okay that he's fine that everybody will be fine at the end of the day so moving on they had a photo shoot um for the ep launch album cover or something even ep launch cover you know they went there and you know they started the shoot and the pictures i think they're really going to come out nice so moving on when they got home yomi brought this whole thing again with this social media um you know pressure fans and all of that and he literally showed Lekon. Lekon got upset like literally he was like see i don't like this thing no they show me like he literally got up he was angry like i could feel i think this like the first time i'm seeing Lekon like angry on the show he was literally angry he walked into another room he wanted to call his mom and the cameraman literally wanted to follow him he was like hey hey oga <laughs> no come near me don't come he literally told the guy, told the cameraman that see don't come i need my space and all of that you know he called his mom because we know i mean lekon has said it over and over again he has a very good relationship with his mom he loves his mom and all of that so at that point i guess the person or the best person that he wanted to talk to was his mom and he didn't want any you know camera filming what he was saying with his mom so the cameraman with his big head still went inside and started filming in one small hope and when Lekon saw it, Lekon was like, nah, 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 that, no, that he doesn't want this to be aired. And his mom definitely was asking him questions, giving him advice and all of that. He was like, see, he's tired of this whole thing, blah, blah, blah. And his mom, of course, you know, soothing, giving him soothing words and all of that. So basically, that's how episode eight ended. Yes, that's how episode eight ended. So we'll see what happens in episode nine. So um, I'll see you guys in my next one. If you like this video, please give me a very big thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please hit the subscribe button. Turn on the bell so that you can get notified anytime I post a video. See you all in my next one. Bye.